All right, hi everybody. It is Coral Island time. How are you all doing? I hope you are having a lovely uh, day today. I had a fairly decent day today, a little bit better than yesterday. <laughs> so my birthday was yesterday and um, I won't say it wasn't the worst, I won't say it was the worst birthday I've ever had. It was definitely, it was definitely the, like the top 10 though, for sure. Um, I just had a ton of work drama yesterday and it just kind of, it was a mess, but I'm excited to be here. I'm excited to play some Coral Island. Um, I'm still a little bit sick. <coughs> so if you hear me still cough some, um, I will try to keep that at a minimum. I have some cough drops if I really need to. This cold just really doesn't want to go to go away for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why. So, um, but I'm excited to play uh, some Coral Island tonight. Um, it's really cute that it came out on my birthday. It's just kind of fun that like so, that it fully released my birthday. So if you haven't been following um, just Coral Island news just in general. So um, Coral Island has been in development for like a year now. Um, they had, or it's at least been early access for like a year. When Coral Island first sort of debuted last year, there was a lot of like drama, I guess. There was a lot of criticism around the fact that like a lot of the gameplay mechanics seem to be almost directly ripped from Stardew Valley, like just straight one-to-one -one ripped. And like, I remember watching a couple people playing at the time and being like, eh, I'll see how this develops. Um, and it has developed a lot since then. Um, and I'm really excited to get into it and play it because the theming is really, really cool. I think it's still, from what I can tell, I think it has a lot of similarities to Stardew, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. Um, it seems to be improving upon a lot of the places where Stardew Valley kind of fell short. Um, and it's very specifically themed, but we're going to get into that. Also, uh, the other thing that's fun about Coral Island is um, everybody's hot. <laughs> All of the NPCs are really hot. Like, I know we always joke that everyone in Paley is hot too, but like everyone in like Coral Island is like, way too hot for their own good. So, uh, thought, you know, very Scorpio season vibes. Let's go, uh, check out all the hot people. Um, and we will just get started. Let me turn down my music here. Okay. And then we are going to get playing. So make sure the music is still, we're getting some audio. Yes, we're getting some audio. Okay, good. New game. Okay. Time for us to figure out what body type we are. Okay. Oh, that's fun. They have kind of like a androgynous, androgynous option. That's kind of cute. Um, but we'll definitely pick female for now. So female. Oh, you can pick kind of body mass. That's cute. Oh, that's cool that they have like different, different options, body size options. I think going to a little bit more true to myself, I think we'll probably do about sort of a middling uh, kind of vibe. And let's pick a skin tone. I think I always typically try to pick like a peachy undertone because I have kind of like a orangey, I guess, undertone to my skin in real life. So um, I think we'll go with that. Uh, let's see. So let's pick what hairstyle we want. Oh, that's kind of cute. Yeah, I think I was getting a little bit of lag when I was loading it up. So we're going to have to play around with it and see if we can't find something that works. Oh, oh, wow. That is, that is detailed. That's fun. Um, oh, the pigtails are cute. I like the pigtails. Looks like there's a lot of options, which is really good. That's kind of nice too. We've got the long hair. A lot of people from what I've seen have picked the long hair. Oh, that's also kind of fun. We've got very billowy hair. Um, also, I'm going to go ahead and pick the color as well. Interesting. So there's kind of uh, like three different shades of blonde, it seems. That's like a honeyish. I'm like, well, okay, so that is more platinum blonde. That's regular and that's honey. I think we're going to go more honey vibes. You can customize the colors. Oh, well, thank you for catching that. Um, okay. Okay. Ooh, you can go bright shining gold. That's kind of fun. We could do that if we wanted to do kind of like a fantasy for the skin and the hair. Yeah. If we want to do like kind of like a fantasy number, that might be kind of fun. Very bright gold hair. Um, so I gotta figure out what hairstyle I want though. Oh, that's a cool undercut. Got some curlies, some big curlies. I always love to see some good textured hair options in games. Kind of got like a long straight. Some of these are more Gen Z style, I think, than 
what I would probably go with personally. I feel like I kind of, I don't know, the Ren Rengoku slash, uh, this looks like Rengoku hair. It also kind of looks like Ariana Grande a little bit, I think. But uh, let's see. I kind of like that one too. That's a little more modest though. Um, I think for vibes, I think we're going to go with maybe this. I think they said, uh, I think I've seen someone say that you can change uh, your appearance later if you want to. So that is good. But thank you for noticing the customize option. That's actually really convenient. Um, oh, and I guess you could customize the skin tone, couldn't you? Uh, ooh, ooh, okay. And then you can change the brightness. Okay. Oh, wow, that actually is really convenient. I don't want to go too tan here, but like, okay. Face. Oh, good. We've got a few match hair. Mm. Actually, I don't know if maybe I want to make it a little bit darker. Uh, maybe make them a little bit darker than the, the hair just because to stand out. I think that's good. Maybe. Yeah, I think that's good. Okay. And then we just got to pick, pick what uh, style we like. I do like a thicker brow. I am someone who likes me a little bit of a thicker brow. Um, there's that. Style three is kind of nice. I also think I like that style five. I think that's cute. I'm into that. Um, okay. Eyes. Oh, it'd good. We get to pick eye color as well. Um, oh, we can finally kind of make our own hazel adjustment. Um, that's like a yellow. Let's see. Let's see. That's a little... No, we want full saturation, but we just need to figure out, like, the darkness. I think that's maybe good. It's kind of difficult to achieve, like, real hazel eyes in games, but you can kind of get kind of close. Um, okay, I think that's good for eyes, maybe. Oh, let's let's pick what style. So we got more of a liner. We got a little bit narrower, a bit wider. Um, rounder. Well, those are cute. Whoa. That's very open. One, two. I think I might like style four. Um, so this is a weird, uh, so I am gonna do face cam someday. Um, I'm just not ready for it quite yet, but uh, my face is not a secret. Um, if you look at my, so at my personal Instagram, um, it's Amy's love letter. Uh, if you look at my personal Instagram, I do have pictures of myself up. I actually have very big eyes proportionally in real life to my face. Um, they're not like massive or anything, but just kind of like in comparison to my face shape. They're, it's kind of hard to see the full effect of them sometimes because I wear glasses, at least for now I wear glasses. Someday I'd like to wear contacts. Um, so it hides it just a little bit, but I have big eyes. Uh, so I think that's like a good, good match for that. Okay, picking the nose is always the hardest thing in games because no matter what, noses look weird. Like it doesn't matter what you do, noses are always gonna look weird when you look at them just sort of like sans context. They have a lot of options, don't they? Um, let me see, style six, seven, eight. I mean, they're cute noses though, actually. I'm being completely honest with you. Uh, maybe kind of a rounder nose. I think I have a little bit of a rounder nose. Uh, and lip style. Okay, we'll need a match skin. Oh, and then unlock for the match skin. Gotcha. Um, I'm fine with giving me a little bit of a lip, but we definitely need to like adjust some colors or whatever. Um, yeah, I think that's nice. I kind of like a pleasant, I mean, Coral Island jokes, but like, I kind of like a pleasant coral. Um, I have like an orange undertone to my skin. So kind of corals look really good. I'm not a big lipstick person, personally. I kind of like, I tend to like glosses more or like, I think if I ever got a chance to play around with like lip stains, I think that'd be more my vibe. I do like makeup a lot and I miss getting to wear makeup more frequently. Um, I love experimenting with makeup, but just haven't had a lot of a chance lately. Um, so let's pick the style. It's fuller. Um, my brain just like, I'm looking for pleasant. I don't know what pleasant technically falls under, but I feel like this is kind of pleasant with a little bit of a smile, maybe. 
obviously every lip shape and size and color is totally valid. Um, I'm just uh, figuring out which one I like the best for myself. Let me see. I think I liked... Yeah, I think I like that one the best. I think that's good. Okay. Well, so far we are looking very cute, which I am vibing with. I love how like jiggly the hair is. That's really fun. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Um, we don't need any facial hair. Okay, outfits. I wonder if we get to change this later or if this is just kind of how it is. Option two, option three. <coughs> Excuse me. We got a little uh, green one. Five eight um hmm i kind of like this warm tone one a little bit or the green one but i feel like i always wear green in games like this that's just a monochromatic blue the gray is kind of fun too i'm not gonna lie um option six option five huh green's good i think i like this one the best maybe yeah, and I'm also, I think I'm gonna adjust the body slider down slightly, I think. Mm. There we go. It's always, I appreciate them adding a, a body slider for different um, uh, different body types. That's really cool that they have a slider. It just can always be kind of difficult to kind of match your own body type IRL, if that makes sense. Oh, okay. Um, honorific. Ms. Um, name is gonna be Amy. And then, oh, okay, what's our farm name? <coughs> That's actually a really good question. I haven't thought about that. Um, hmm. Oh, heck, I didn't even think about the fact that we were gonna have to name the farm. Um, what should we name it? We're kind of going for like, so it's tropical. Um, I think it gives me Pacific Islander vibes. I don't know if that's exactly what they're going for, but it's Pacific Islander vibes. Um, um, I kind of want to like, yeah, I think I'm going to call it, I call it my Animal Crossing this all the time, but I think Ambrosia. I think I'll go with Ambrosia. Ambrosia is just fun. I grew up eating fruit Ambrosia. My, uh, my Southern grandma would make it. And fruit Ambrosia, if you didn't know, is really difficult to make. Like it's very like, um, well, if you do it right, <laughs> hot takes, um, if you do it right, uh, um, it can be very time consuming as you have to peel like the extra skin off the, the oranges and stuff um, and kind of split them up and split them apart. But I think I'll call the call it Ambrosia because that just reminds me of fun stuff. We don't need to skip any of the intro cutscene because I want to see the intro cutscene. Now I'm just like, I'm self-conscious about these eyebrows. <laughs> I don't know if they're right or not. Hold on. Um, do we need to make them brighter? Is that right? Okay. Maybe. Oh God. I don't style my brows in real life. Like I'll trim up the edges, but I don't style them in real life. So I'm having a hard time telling if they're like right or not. I have the hair very like unnaturally vivid, which is totally fine. I just don't know if the brows match. I guess that's good enough. I guess we can go. This is also, you know what this hair is also giving me? It's giving me Aloy from um, Horizon Zero Dawn. So that's fun too. Okay, let's go. I think I have, I think we've done it. Okay. Intro cutscene. I'm excited. Yes. Change the clothes and hairstyle later. Perfect. Okay. Time to be introduced to the world of Coral Island. Very hype. Very, very hype indeed. I love their little, you can't see it. I was about to say I love their little loading screen logo, <coughs> but y'all can't see it. My PNG tuber's blocking it. That's okay. Oh, here we go. Oh, we're getting a little bit of lag. It's okay. It's still loading, but y'all can't see it. There we go. You leave Pokyo to start a new life on Coral Island. Oh, here we go. Oh, there's turtles. Oh, there's turtles. Oh, it's is that a chicken boat? That's a chicken boat. That's a chicken. Dolphins! Dolphins. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's concerning. I don't like that black sludge stuff. Oh, but there's someone playing with their dog. That's cute. Oh, hello. Connor. Hello, Amy. Welcome back to Coral Island, your new home. 
It's been a long time, Amy. Good to see you again. I can't remember the last time we had a visitor. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. I don't know why, but he's giving me, I think the art style for him in particular is giving me Lilo and Stitch for some reason. I don't know why, but there's something about the way that like his face is drawn and stuff is giving me Lilo and Stitch. I think it's really cute. Um, I trust you had a wonderful journey with Mr. Wateroo. Um... Yeah, it was safe and comfortable. I'm still not sure what I'll do here, and it's weird. It feels like I've done this before, maybe another life. Well, I haven't done it before, and it was safe and comfortable, I'm assuming. Great. I expected nothing less from Mr. Wateroo. He's the best sailor you could ask for. You must be quite tired from the journey. Jur oh, journey? God, I can't speak. Let's head over to your place. Will do. Bye, Mr. Wateroo. Thank you for the trip. Oh, oh, it's cute. Oh, I wonder what that, like... <laughs> basement dungeon thing. Oh my god. Hello? Joko. Alright, the four of the floors are done. Dinda. Oh my. What a coincidence. Hi everybody. We just finished patching things up here. Is this the new farmer? That's right. Amy. That's right. Amy, this is Dinda and Joko. They're the local carpenters. Nice to meet you, Amy. Hello, Amy. It's always exciting to welcome someone new to our little island. Cute, but run down. Which is how these things always start. Indeed, Amy, this will be your new house. It's a bit run down, but... Ahem, excuse me, Mayor Connor. Did you just say we did a poor job here? No, that's not what we meant. <laughs> the little... The little... <laughs> stress sweat. Eh? N uh, no, I mean... <laughs> oh, they were kidding. Don't worry, I'm just joking. Unfortunately, we can only patch up the roof so it doesn't leak and replace some of the rotten wood. If you want more renovations, you can visit our shop in House and Hillside, northeast of here. Okay. We won't charge you for it, but you'll need to gather materials yourself. Hey, that's convenient. Sorry we will charge you an arm and a leg and plus materials, so that's actually very convenient. How nice of them. Once we restore the foundation, you can decorate the house in, in the way you like. We place the complete instructions in your mailbox. Okay, good. We got a mailbox. That actually is a, that's a really cute mailbox. Well, then it's about time we head home. See you both around. Take care, Amy, and good luck. Bye. Cute. I know that a big emphasis in this game is going to be about, like, community and stuff, and I'm excited for that. As you can see, people are very excited you're here. Doubly so for Sam. You should pay him a visit once you're more settled in. He's the owner of the general store in town. Okay, general store. Good to know. Looks like it's evening where we're at. And that is the field where I'm guessing you'll spend most of your time. Yep, it's a bit of a mess. They always are. Oh, there's trash. Ugh. <laughs> we're like, really? What are we supposed to do with all this? Stress? Oh, oh my god. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's an appropriate reaction. It's a bit messy now, but I'm sure you'll take care of it in no time. Hey, that's plenty of space, though. That's good. Yeah, who is sweating? Excuse me. Oh, remember to drink water, everybody. Very important. Once you harvest your crops, you can put them in them or anything else you have to sell here in the shipping bin. I'll ship the content overnight to the appropriate stores in town, and you'll receive the funds the following day. Good. Oh, I love that little, like, boardwalk circling that pond. That's really cute. I'll be going now so you can get some rest. Oh, since you just got here, you probably haven't bought anything you need for farming yet. Here's a little something from the town to get you started. Oh, that's nice of them. You received a watering can, an axe, a scythe, and some random seeds. Cute. If you need anything else, I'm at your disposal. Come to me with problems, questions, and some mean sake. Nice. Welcome home, Amy. Cute. Oh, the waving by. That's adorable. This is a game's really pretty. Like, oh, <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Wow. It really is run down in here. Okay. Oh, the graphics are so cute. Like the little, the HUD, I guess, is really cute. Oh, and the little heart next to the time. That's cute. Wow. It is run down in here. That, that is for sure. Um, okay. Got a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, okay. And then they said they're going to have instructions for us. So let's see. Read mail. Amy, to repair your house, we'll need you to gather some materials. Please collect 50 wood and 20 stone. After you collect everything, head to the carpenter store and create an order at the counter. Your house will be repaired on the same day. On the same day? Dang. 
That is, uh, that is very convenient. Okay, whoa, we're getting a lot of stuff thrown at us. Farming. To grow co a crop, start by clearing debris from your farmland. Press uh, this while equipping a scythe, pickaxe, or axe to clear debris. Then equip the hoe and press uh, right mouse button, or left mouse, whatever, sides. Mouse button to clear the soil. Next, equip a seed bag and press it to place seeds on till soil. Finish by equipping your watering can and pressing it to water the seeds. Crops need to be watered daily until they're ready for harvest. Okay, good to know. Um, I'm assuming... Okay. Dink. Oh my god. Okay. Dink. There we go. Um, I guess I can get the scythe out. And get these weeds. Very good. Probably one of the first orders of business we're going to need to do is, um... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Good to know that we have a energy bar up here. That'll be important. Oh, wow. How do you clear the trash? Oh, you can clear the trash. You just... Oh, my gosh. Okay. Nice. Um, glass. Oh, wow. So, yeah, probably one of the first things we'll need to worry about is getting, like, a chest down. Um, just so that we can have room. Because I, I don't think our inventory will be able to keep all of it. Okay. Smackety smack. We need to get some wood. Actually, I don't think anybody's taught us how to make a chest yet. So, I guess that's a whole thing. Hold on. Let me get this tree first. Nice crash. Okay, um, is there like a... Ooh, resume game. Um, oh, that's a message. P. Farm view mode. Okay, well, wow, it's huge. I mean, that's great. It means we're going to have a ton of space to be able to put anything. I love the pond. I love the little, like, boardwalks next to the pond. Like, that'll be where we can fish from, but that's actually really convenient. Toggle UI. Ooh. Oh, nice. That'd be, like, good for, like, taking, like, pictures and stuff. Like, screenshots. Um, well, that wasn't <coughs> however we craft. I'm not sure how we craft. I guess maybe they haven't told us yet. No mail. I guess they just want us to, to, to gather some wood and stone and to plant some stuff, potentially. So we'll get some of these rocks out of the way. Do we need to... Are you a rock? No, you're not. You're just in the ground. Boom. 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 Nope. Boom. 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 What is that? Are you like a seed or something? I don't know what that is. It's like a little triangle on the ground. Then we'll get this. Oh, that didn't give us any stone. Okay. Oop. We'll just figure things out as we go. I'm sure we can craft a chest at some point once our inventory gets full. Okay, we can need to keep getting wood as well. 50 is a pretty decent amount. I'm not really sure what we're supposed to do once we run out of energy. I guess we'll just um, farm as much as we can for this first day. Oh, there we go. We'll farm as much as we can for this first day and then kind of uh, maybe go explore the town a little bit. Because it seems like it's still early in the morning, so that's kind of convenient. Um... I don't know what you are. Oh, inventory is already full. Great. Um, let's see. Well, they want us to farm a little bit, so I guess maybe let's get a hoe out. Oh, it let me click and hold, which is kind of weird. Oh, there we go. Oh, we got more trash. They definitely seem to have a trash problem on this island, which I'm sure that's something we're going to be helping them with. Um, okay, we'll just plant seeds. Let's go ahead and put the other ones down, then we can just do hoe all of it at the same time. Looks like we're almost out of energy. I'm sure there's probably ways to, like, eat food or something in order to get more energy. We'll go into town and we'll see if anybody... Oh, wait, no, they get, they gave us candy. Oh, is that, like... Is that the... That's, like, um... Um... Not rock candy, but it looks like little bubbles. That's really cute. I wonder if that's like a um, Asian style candy that I just don't know about. I know a lot of Eastern Asian countries have extremely cute food. And I look forward on trying all of it in someday in the future. Oh, okay. Harvest your first crop and visit Sam's General Store. Let's see. <coughs> okay. Okay, good. So they've got some information for us. All right, we will visit Sam's. Um, I'm glad we have some food so that we can not run out of energy and we can keep uh, working. Oh yeah, we're getting real low. Let's see, munch, 
Consume candied tree seed. Huh. That's interesting. I mean, that's very cute. Oh, it didn't give us very much energy, did it? What is this? Sap. It is sap. Oh my god. I'm sure some people are going to be starting cults around sap in this the same way they did with Stardew. It's all right. It's inevitable. <coughs> oh my goodness. Man, wow, we're chewing through our food. Food. Energy. We're chewing through our energy kind of fast, huh? That's okay. I want to see if I can get... Come on. Oh, there we go. Okay. I want to see... Ooh. Okay, we got the we got the wood that we needed. I, I want to see if we can try to get our um, house upgraded today. That would be very convenient, if so. The candy tree... That's a really interesting thing to candy, but they're super, super cute. A craftable snack to that satisfy thrifty foragers. Huh. Okay. Rock. 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 Some of these hit in one, and some of these hit in two, and I keep not having any idea which is which. Um... Any more rocks? I would like some rocks. Oh, it looks like we've got some seeds and stuff, but our inventory's full. I don't really know how to craft yet, so I guess we're just gonna have to like leave it there and hope it stays there until we find out. Rock, 17. Oh, 19 out of 20? 20. 20 out of 20, excellent. Visit the carpenter. Let me, oh my God, I'm stuck. Okay, all right. Actually, while we're here, might as well. Never mind. There is no save option. Okay. Um, well, we're good on that front. So I guess we're just gonna. <coughs> Sorry, my brain just sort of pooped itself. Um, do we have a map? Mm. Pressing M for map does in fact bring up the map. Oh wow. Oh, this is huge. It's so much bigger than Stardew's map was. Also, I'm not trying to sit here and, like, compare it to Stardew all the time. I just know that, like, that is the only other game that I have played that's kind of, uh, been similar to this. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so town, beach, lookout, garden lane, forest, woodlands. Holy cow. Um, oh, there's relationship. Oh, okay, these are the people that we met. Connor. Before he became the mayor, Connor used to run his own general store with his late wife, Carol. Where's a hat? Oh, that's cute. Rest in peace, Carol. Dinda is a local carpenter. She says carpentry is a passion, not a job. She tends her herb garden and busies herself with community activities in her free time. Oh, and they give us their birthday. That's really... Oh, and you get loves and likes. That's convenient. Oh, and you can, like, discover their different outfits and expressions. That's really cute. Also, oh, and the things they hate. That's nice. That's nice. And then Joko... Joko is a local carpenter. He's married to Dina, who's also a carpenter. And he has a family on a neighboring Ireland and island and visits them now and then. That's so cute. I love that. And then we have, oh, crafting. Oh, we can make a fence. Uh, or we can make fence. Oh, the fence with the trash. <laughs> Why is that so cute? Okay. Makeshift path and wooden trash. Uh, uh, oh, um, stone path, wood path. Oh, those are cute. Hold on. We're going to go craft a chest real quick. Um, I, uh, so I did get some hot tips and tricks, um, from, uh, not that a YouTuber that I, I, I follow sometimes on what to do when you're full, when your inventory is full and I can just pop it in there real quick make a chest or two. Just got rid of the wood that we were going to use to upgrade our house. Mm. Excellent. Good, good, good. Glad for that. Um, let's put the fiber in here. Let's put the coal and compost and glass. That's fun. Let's get that stuff back out of here again. We need to get more wood because I was a bit of a dum dum and I didn't even think about that. Yeah. How much wood did we need? It was like, was it 50? I, ah, uh, I caramba. Um, okay. Let's see if we can get that back, maybe. I don't know if we can with our our energy for the day, but I guess we can try, huh? Um, let's see. Nope, not that. Wackus. Nope. Wackus bonkus. You naughty wackus bonkus. Okay, low stamina, I know. Next. <laughs> Equip or food or drink. Okay, go to bed to replenish the stamina. All right. Oh, no, let's eat this. Eat the candied tree seed. Hope and pray that we have enough energy to get us to uh, 50. Oopsie poopsie. 
I mean, I'm assuming the general store will probably have food, right? Somebody will have food. Wait. 59. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, I think narrowly escaped disaster. Okay. I don't know if there's a way you to, like, clear... Oh, that's so pretty. That's so pretty. I love... Oh, my God, it's so pretty. I love it. It's a little laggy. I, I hope that's not translating too terribly bad. Oh, okay. Starlet Town Farm and... Di di I want to read it. West Farm, East Town, South Diving. Succinct. Okay, we got a big town square here. There's a butterfly. Oh, scared it. I'm sorry, Mr. Butterfly. I didn't mean to scare you like that. I didn't know you were there. Oh, there's stuff around. Okay. Oh, harvest. Oh, I can gather things. Oh, it's a violet. There's a puppy. Can I not? Oh, wait, wait. I think I can hit this with my hoe, right? Yes. Wild seeds. Fun. There's a puppy. Can I get in and pet the puppy? I don't think so. I think. Oh, wait, wait. Can I speak to him? No. Okay. Um. Oh, it's a. Oh, it's an animal shelter. Oh, it's an animal shelter. Well, I guess we're just gonna check things out. Wait a minute. I thought I set my. I just realized I set. Hold on. Settings. I. <laughs> I thought I set the time. Twenty-four hour. Oh, a.m. P.M. Oopsies. Oopsie poopsie. Apply. Yes. I can't do military time. I just can't. I can't. Okay, 440. That works. Hi. Who are you? Jack. Ooh. Ooh, it begins. Man. You're thick. I mean. Wow. No, I'm not even going to kid. That's a thick boy. You're a thick boy, sir. Just call me Jack. I'll run the local ranch. Your lot has plenty of space to raise livestock. Once you're settled, maybe we can discuss raising animals. Wow, you're gonna make some people want to raise some other things with you, but that's fine. Um, oh, oh no. Oh, babies. Oh, the baby. Oh my God, they have a whole, oh, hi. Hello, can I talk to you? No? How, how do I talk? Bast is busy and can't talk right now. Oh my God, there's food, all the litter box. Hello? Are you puppers? Inari! Oh, Inari looks happy today! I want all of you. Oh my god, the whole, the whole climbing? Oh my god. I'm sorry, are you a fox? Oh, Luna! Oh my god, it's a fox! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, and there's a lizard! There's a lizard! Lindy! Lindy looks happy today! Oh my god! Inspect. This is a serious amount of pet food. No pets will go hungry ever. Oh my good oh, bunny. There's a bunny. Hippostrium? Hippostrium. Oh my god. You have hearts on you. What on? I know I'm going to be able to adopt one of you. How am I supposed to choose? How am I supposed to choose? I know they're only going to let me have one. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I'm speechless. Wait. Okay. Shopped or shop adopt pet <gasps> pet house pet but pet pet beds <gasps> oh no oh my good adopt pet <gasps> oh no oh no <laughs> oh no <gasps> okay Luna Inari Spike Bonkers Spike Bo K Kaylin I think you would like this one <laughs> Spike Bonkers. He looks like a pity. Um, Spiker Do. Spiker Do and Spike Bonkers. Bode. Cody. Fizz. Getty. Lindy. Hippastrium. Copper. Trinket. Oh, Trinket's cute. Trinket. Kit Kat. Malcolm. Mr. Fluff. Omar. Kimba. K Gary Coon. Oh, Gary Coon's cute. Frankie. Oh, Frankie has sass. And then bass. Can I can't. You're going to make me pick one. And I hate that so, so much. Hello, more people. You're shirtless. Okay, you're shirtless. I got to prep myself for this. The Theo. Oh, yeah, yeah. I heard about you. You're that new farmer from San Francisco, right? I thought it was like po Pokio. Ah, that's right. Pokio. I'm Theo. 
I'm like stress sweat <laughs> stress sweating. <coughs> oh, hey. <coughs> Are these like segues? Starlet Town free wheel free wheelchair rental. That's so nice of them. Oh my god. I'm literally gonna be spending most of my time just like today tonight, just like exploring the town and the people. And I don't mind that at all. Just holy cow. I'm assuming this is where uh, Mr. Mayor sits. Hello, can I look? It's a lot of official paperwork you don't understand. Okay, cool. Oh my god, did they have to introduce Theo shirtless? I'm like stress sweating now. Oh, it's nighttime! Oh, there's a little moon! It's, it's a little moon to show it's nighttime. <coughs> I did not visit the general store at all. Oh, they're all in bed. They were going to bed. Yes, I see. Okay, featured. Wow, there's not a lot of stuff in here. It looks like it's like a, a trinket store or a bookstore or something, but there's not a lot of choices. This section is empty. Oh, do we get like, is it supposed to be messy like this? Oh, do we get like, like in Stardew, you a legendary fish and where to find them? Yes, it's kind of like Stardew where you fill out like uh, advice books or whatever. Oh, we don't get to read it. It just says it. Uh, read. Re Next. Oh, okay. Maybe I can't read it yet. Oh, look, a little bonsai. That's cute. Hello. Millie. Oh, she's really cute. That's Bestie's energy. Yes, Amy. I've been meaning to meet you. My name is Millie. It's so exciting to have people moving in. Oh, that's cute. She's adorable. It looks like, yeah, it looks like, oh, it's going to be a library. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Um, nice to see you. That's cute. You don't have any book to donate. Okay. It's open. Is it ever closed? All right, cool cool town hall this is the, hey we found the town hall everybody oh hey that's a big tablet that is a big stone tablet oh hey look it's a little like aquarium oh it's a model of the beach this is coral island and that's the pier that's cute okay uh coral island map just says coral island map okay uh anything to inspect here maintenance ledger it's just a maintenance ledger. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, Starlet Town rank. Nothing. Clearly, that's something we're going to work on in the future. Oh, they give speeches over here. That's good. It's like 8 o'clock at night. Oh, yeah. We should probably go to bed, shouldn't we? <coughs> hey, Theo. You still there? Hey, Theo. How are you? You intimidate me. You, in you intimidate me. Um. Well, it's late at night. I guess we probably won't be able to do much, huh? I can try to, I can try to like, we can try and see if anything's open. <gasps> Look at the little shells hanging from the arch. That's stupidly cute. Okay. Um, we're in downtown. Uh, Woodland Lake. Can I, can I view this? No. Woodland Lake and Beach. Oh, hey, there's people. Hi. Derek. Wow. Wow. He's a Derek. What did you say? You can't hear me. It's nice to be outdoors, don't you agree? Don't wink at me, please. I'm not hot enough to be here. This is ridiculous. Uh, uh construction, fun. I guess we'll maybe see if I can go find um, the general store and see if it's, I mean, it's like 10 o'clock at night, so probably not, but where are we? Oh, blacksmith. Okay, to 1800. Hey, I thought we, I put everything on the AM PM. Is it still not showing? It's clo it's closed. Nine to twenty. I wish. It okay, I'll have to see if I can fix that later because I am not a uh, boxes of war. Nice. Um, I'm not a mil <coughs> military time person. My parents did military time for a little while growing up because my mom was a nurse and my dad, I don't know, was in the army for. <gasps> Forget my parents. This is way more important. Oh my god. Oh, oh we fell off <coughs> again. Again. <coughs> this is way more oh my god oh oh we fell wait can we play with the other things this is very important to me no no okay can we swing no okay okay that's fine am i the person that goes to uh the the playground and still plays on it absolutely you can't stop me school it's closed okay I guess I'm just trying to, there's a, there's a food truck, but it seems to be closed right now too. I'm kind of just trying to like scope the area out. I mean, it is 11. We should probably like go back home at some point. Do they have fast travel? Oh, there's a firefly. Firefly. This is probably the carpenters, I would assume. Yeah. Okay. 
Well, we'll go home then. <coughs> we'll go home and we'll try to explore more of the town uh, tomorrow. <coughs> Which will be nice. <coughs> Sorry. I am still sick. I love the little spirit lanterns everywhere. That's really cool. Okay. We will... Oh, hello. You're a person? You're a person. Hi. Luke. Yes. May I help you? My name's Luke. Pleasure's mine. Okay, Luke. Well, I met Luke. I do be meeting Luke. Are we lost? Maybe. Uh, yeah, it is getting late. I know I'm trying to go home. Where's, um... Down. Where's home? It's down. Museum? Okay. And it's closed. Interesting. You don't pass out, do you? I don't know. We're going to find out, I guess. Time to find out the hard way. <laughs> I might make it back in time, though. I really do like the hair. It's actually really cute. I'm, it's growing on me. <coughs> the hairstyle. I know it's probably hecka dark for you guys to, to see, but that's okay. It will be morning soon. Hopefully they have something like the glow ring in, in Stardew so that we can run around and not be insanely dark. Okay, bedtime. Go to bed. And then we will, um, day one ended. Mm. I didn't put anything in the, that's all right. Next day. Oh, do you only save at the end of days? I actually do need to think about that. Can you save at any time? Uh, return to title. Um, that's something I'm actually going to have to look at because we might have to modulate the length of stream based off of how long the days are. Okay, good morning, everybody. Uh, if they don't let me save at any time. <coughs> New item alert. Interesting. Basic bag has a total of 20, 20 compartments. That is a whole extra five compartments that basic, the basic tool be belts. Carry more, do more, worry less. Available now at Sam's General Store for 300 coins. Oh, more mail. Oh, no. That's just... Okay. That was it. Okay, cool. Um, I did forget to put... We have this violet scavengeable maple seeds wild seeds i guess i don't want to sell too much yet because i don't know what's like what's worth things and what isn't if that makes any sense um but we do need to go water all of our um crops we do a little water and a little water and a little water and a little water a little water and a little water oh did i not recover all of my stamina last night maybe that's what happens if you don't go home on time that might have been it that's all right. I think I want to spend most of today trying to figure out where things are. Because this place is huge. Like, we just walked so far. Oh. Refill watering can. Equip. Refill. Don't have a well yet. Carpenters can build one for you. Okay. Let us fill water. Convenient. Need to finish watering our little cropsies. Boop. Okay. Everybody's watered. We're going to see if we can't make our way downtown. Making my way downtown. I <laughs> keep exploring a little bit and see if we can't find where stuff is. Okay. Let us see. Oh, person, 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 person. Hello. I greet you. Suki. Oh, she's cute. I love the purple hair. Oh, hey, it's nice to see you again. Uh, do we know each other? It'll be nice to have more farmers here. Maybe. Being able to get local produce will be a game changer. It looks like she's uh, working out. Good for you, Suki. Oh, hi. Who are you? Who are you? Come here. Person. Oh, you got sass. She's struck. Erica. Hey, you. Is this our new neighbor? Making your way around town, huh? Have you been to the tavern yet? Frank is there all the time. Have you two met? Um. Uh, no. Who's Frank? Oh, he's my husband. Do you know what? You should stop by our house sometime. Frank will cook us dinner. That sounds wonderful. Yes, you can tell us your story. Oh, that'd be wonderful. I would love that. Everyone's so nice. Oh, there's people. There's all the people. Alice. Hi, Alice. Is is that you, Amy? Wow, I almost didn't recognize you in that getup. Oh, so you're the one moving the lot, huh? That would explain the outfit. Oh, so, yeah. We're allegedly from here, so that makes sense. <coughs> wow. Chame? I think that's how you pronounce that, her name. Um, she intimidates me. I like that. You're the new arrival, huh? Don't bother me, and I won't bother you. Ha! Yeah, sake. Okay, calm down. Person. Oliver. Oh, my name. Oh, look at his little <laughs> kind of police and then the little detective. My name? Hmm. My name's Oliver. Why? Uh, because I was saying hello and being nice to you, small child. I understand the hesitation, though. New people are scary. 
especially as a small child. Closed. I can't read it. Can I read you? No, I can't. Okay. Hi, Archie. Are you really the new person? Dad said you were a farmer. Is that right? What kind of farming tools do you have? Okay, I believe you. Why don't you look like a farmer, though? Okay, that's a little offensive. I'm doing my best. I get I'm green or whatever. People. You're the new farmer who owns that lot. I used to play there with my friends. Oh, well, I'm sorry. Oh, there's a vineyard up there. That's fun. <gasps> Bubby. Taco! Taco! You say hello to Taco. He seems to like it, and that's all that matters. Taco! We met Taco! Oh, and then there's another person. Hello. How hot are you? Luke. Oh, we've met Luke. There's no way better to spend the day than being outside, especially in weather like this. I wish I wish we had good weather right now. We have goodish weather. Who are you? Oh, Zara. A new farmer in town? You moved here after the oil spill? Huh. I'm Zara. See you around. Zara is too cool for everyone. <coughs> Our weather has been kind of like stormy lately, I guess. Oh, hello. More people. Raphael. Oh, hi there. Oh, hi. Hi, Raphael. My name is Raphael. Um, I'm one of the blacksmiths here in Starlet Town. Okay. Hi, Raphael. Ooh. Hold on. There's like a little note or like a little book up here. Is it supposed to look like that? It looks incomplete. Interesting. Incomplete, you say. I need to find the general store. Where? Where? Oh. The map shows it. Stranger, stranger, one townie. Oh, that's kind of cool. They tell you. Oh, they tell you where they are. Oh, my God. That's incredibly convenient. So that way you don't have to, like, stress yourself. That's beautiful. Okay. Um, School. Vineyard greenhouse. Vineyard shed. Clinics. Charles's house, clothing store, furniture, socket electronics, excuse me, Ling's lab, strangers. These are strangers. These are people we haven't met yet. Millie and Yuri's house. Where is the, um, Zoe and Paul's house. Where's the, where's the general store? Everyone's telling me to go to the general store. Jack, Jira, Kira's house. It's home. Am I like, not dumb, socket electronics clinics, clothing store, furniture, Ling's lab. Where, where is the, the general store? Hot spring, Ben's caravan, two townies. I, uh, lighthouse, coral inn, Sunny's beak shack. I'm, I'm, I'm genuinely lost. Where, Charles's house, Sarah's boat, museum, recycling center. I guess we'll see if we can't try to go to Emma and Dippa's house, Zoe Ann and Paul's house, Mayor's house, Stranger Hot Spring, observatory, ranch, Jack here in Kenny's house. Where are we? We we're supposed to go to somebody's house. <coughs> Hold on. Let's see if the quest visit sam's general store um does it not show us on the map where to go for that i guess i guess maybe i'll keep going up and see if i can find beach lookout okay where were we supposed to go again sorry i'm i'm like sam's general store where's the carpenter Okay. Journal. New. Oh. Hi. Oh, Derek. Derek. Oh, Luna. Oh, cute. Okay. These are, oh, these are all the people we've talked to. Uh, bestiary. Fun. Oh, there's so much. Letters. Uh, they told me to come to their house. Um, <laughs> Okay. Where on earth? Home. Jack here in Kenny's house. Mayor's house. Blacksmith. Lily Jimmy Theo. Ling's mansion. Nice. Sa There's Sam's general store. Oh my god. I feel it. Frank and Erica. Okay, so where? <coughs> Excuse me. Community center. Museum. Million Yuri. I'm trying to find where their house is. Ranch. Carpenter. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Let's go to the general store first. <coughs> that stressed me out. Okay. I was like, I'm not insane. Oh, the lab. That's cool. The, co the shells hanging is the cutest thing I've ever seen. There it is. Sam's local produce. Wonderful. Hi, Sam. How are you? Oh, there's a kitty on the roof. That's cute. Oh, hi. Hey, Amy. I knew you'd eventually make it here. I got lost first, but we, we got here. <coughs> I wanted to personally introduce you to the owner of the store. This is Sam. He's been running this establishment for a while now. Hello, Amy. It's a pleasure to meet you. Welcome to the general store. You'll find most of your farming needs here. Most of the seeds I sell are seasonal, though. It would do you good to keep this in mind. If you need help, just holler. I'll be by the cash register. Well, isn't it nice, Sam? You might finally put a dent in that seed stock of yours. <laughs> He's unamused. Anyway, before you get going, Amy, your moving in was quite unexpected. I'm sure a lot of people are anxious, well, more like curious to see who the new farmer is. Why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself to folks in town? I've been doing it, but I can do it some more. Wouldn't, uh, wouldn't hurt at all. Okay. Meet townies. Wow, I've gotten pretty far in that. Local produce. The shelves are a little empty, huh? Inspect. Nothing beats the smell of fresh bread. Yeah, I'm not much of a bread person. I just, I don't like it very much. Shop, upgrade bag. Whoa, noises. Um, wow, okay. Well, I think we already have daisies and turnips plant. Uh, I'm doing it, I guess. Um, we already have daisies and turnips planted, I think. Oh, that was it. That was all I could afford. You know what? That was exactly the amount of money that I had, and then I can buy bread, apparently. Cool. All right. Well, that's the thing. Ooh. <coughs> a local archaeologist seeking a companion for housemate. Independent doctor with a passion for health owns a lucky cat. He is nice. <laughs> Mayor Connor must be kind. Liking burritos is a plus. Contact me. Does he mean, like companion for a house oh like he wants like a, a roommate okay i was like companion for a house house housemate what oh that cutting board oh it's a sink oh that's a cool sink i love that the homes are so huge normally games like don't have that big houses oh there's a you're not close enough to same into this room oh it's 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 his baby 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 room okay i can't go in here either okay good to know Wow, that's so... I love that um, that plant in the pot. That's cool. <coughs> no, I love that... Uh, I love that... Um, oh, there's there's someone here. Hi. Eva. Oh, she's cute. Oh, hi, nice to meet Oh, hi, nice to meet you too. My name's Everest. Oh, and then you just call her Eva for short. Nice. She's the baker. That's lovely. We're getting really close. I think we've already met most of the townies. It's just sort of a wild sweep. Oh, hello. Noah. Oh, hey. I have to say, you're not what I expected. Noah, my goodness. My goodness, Noah. Noah. Did they have to make the men with this kind of these kind of proportions? Like, oh, that is just... They're all thick, and they've all got that Dorito... Mm. They're either like Dorito or refrigerator. Mm. Ooh. <coughs> Hi, Noah. Can we talk more? Oh, no. I didn't mean it in a bad way. I heard from the twins who were on the end that the farmer moved in. I just thought, you know, never mind, that I'd be a man, probably. Oh, there's a notification here. Oh, errands. Okay. Looking for cauliflower. Deadline in two days. Okay. I don't know if I planted a cauliflower today. Oh, cherry blossom. Oh, there's like birthdays and stuff. Okay. Uh, cherry blossom festival. Tree planting festival. Oh, it's like an Earth Day. That's fun. Um, how long do these? Ten days. Yeah, I don't, I can't get them the cauliflower that quick. The birds! on the wire <laughs> oh my goodness they're very cute okay um oh doggy in the fountain what are you doing in the fountain little buddy oh taco hi taco taco you shouldn't be in the <laughs> he's having a good time though these poor fountains are like broken wow um we gotta find the carpenter we gotta find the carpenter and then we'll go back and plant um this stuff where was the carpenter cow carpenter we'll go up Oh, hi. Oh, he's teaching. That's fun. Hi, Randy. Hi, my name's Randy. Oh, he has a prosthetic arm. That's really cool. I'm an elementary school teacher. What'd you say your name was? That's cute. We've already talked to this child, I think. 
but not this one. Valentina, oh, she's sassy. Hello, Miss Amy, nice to meet you too. I'm Valentina. She's cute. Um, yeah, it's really fun here. You get to fly kites and build snowmen in winter. Cute. And then you I've already talked to and you I've already talked to and I think I've talked to you as well. Oh, wait. Ah, uh, yes, Amy, it's nice to meet you. Cool. Um, he's teaching the kids. That's really adorable. Let's go find the carpenter so that we can get our house upgraded and it can be not falling apart. There's a vineyard. There's so much to explore. Wait, am I going the right way? Yes, carpenter. Hello, everybody. Oh, you hear the banging of the cart? That's cute. Go bonk, bonk. Oh, okay. Repair your house. Excellent. Hi. <laughs> I found some wasabi earlier. Is it even in season? Uh, oh. Oh, what can I do for you? Shop, carpenter, house upgrade. Carpenter. Oh, coop. Barn, stable, well source, fish pond, insect house. Ooh. And just an empty building for a shed. Nice. Okay. Um. Shop. Nope, not that. Uh, let's see. Shop. Stone wood calendar. Oh, so it'll tell you what time of year. Small aquarium and then aquarium. That's fun. And then we want house upgrade. House level one. Oh, cute. Yes, I have just enough. Awesome. Thank you. I'll work on it right away. Oh my God. Is it done the same day? Joko, honey, a slight change of plans. Amy's here with the building materials. Let's head over to the farm and repair Amy's cabin. Oh, they're cute. I love, I love the aesthetic. Like the cool, like natural cut wood table with the trees coming out. Wow, that's awesome, Amy. Let's do it. That's so nice of them. It's adorable. Dina and Joko are repairing your house. How are the house upgrades? More comfortable, right? Now move it and help me get your stuff inside, kiddo. Oh, oh, that is cute. Oh, that's so, they're helping me move in. Oh, high five. Oh, that's really adorable. Oh, and they're sitting, we're sitting on the rug, taking a break. Oh no, <laughs> oh no. Don't drop the TV. Oh, that's really cute. Ooh, that old thing was really heavy. We're finished. What do you think, Amy? Uh, how long is the warranty? Looks brand new. Thank you. Isn't it? I'd say we could do it better. Look, no more moldy wood. We replaced all of it. We also built a new foundation for the hat. Just casually built a new foundation, huh? That's impressive. <coughs> that means it's strong enough for more furniture now. You can start decorating to make things comfier. Speaking of decoration... We have a furniture store in town, but since there are fewer tourists, we don't stock many options anymore. No one's buying, you know? Check it out, though. You might see something you like. If you want, we can go there right... All right, that's enough. You'll scare the kid. Oh, sorry, Amy. I got too excited there. We love that store. Even got some of my cousins helping out there. It's a family business for us. Feel free to visit when you have the time, Amy. I will. It's in the middle of town. Shouldn't be too hard to find. Yeah, no, absolutely. We can, we can go check it out. All right, that's all for... Honey, aren't you forgetting something? Oh, we're thinking. Oh yeah, the TV! What about it? We threw in a free TV for you, Amy, free of charge. Oh, that's nice. It's probably pretty old, huh? It's old and bulky, but it still works perfectly. I appreciate that. It gets a good amount of channels too, like this weather... <laughs> bang, bang. There we go, now it's working. Well, sometimes you gotta smack at a good 60 degree angle like this. Listen, older tech, <coughs> that's how it is. You, you give it a couple good smacks and you'll be fine. Also, don't mind me. I'm starting to get tired a little bit. I'm putting a cough drop in. So if you hear some clacking, that's why. The channels are very useful. Like that weather report on the weather channel. So you can skip the watering the crops on the rainy day to go fishing or something. I don't know what you like to do, but you get the idea. There are variety shows too. Some shows have useful tips if you pay close attention. I guess that's all for now. See you around, Amy. Yeah, sorry about <coughs> having to put the cough drop in. My voice is just getting tired. So I will try to keep this clacking sounds to a minimum. But yeah, I'm just going to have a cough drop in. But thank you, Amy. Don't forget about the furniture store, all right? <laughs> There's a lot of ha hang around here. That's okay. Your house just got bigger. 
Amazing. Okay, open journal to claim reward. All right. Um, open le journal to claim reward. Nope. Oh, taco. Luke's little buddy, Taco, loves to dive into waters regardless of the season and enjoy a good nap afterwards. Derek. Derek is a hardworking construction worker who can often be seen at various building sites around town. Derek is like... I don't know why he's giving me Twilight vibes. Maybe it's something about, like, the hair, but he's just giving me Twilight vibes. Uh, oh, my God. Lindy. Bright and alert. This yellow lizard's often seen sunning on the rocks. Cute. Oh, my God. Hard eyes for days. This rabbit's pink heart-shaped pa fur patch is the stuff of bunny love legends. So cute. And Ari. A mesmerizing black and white fox. A long two-tone two tail flows behind, like, a regal banner. And then Luna. With the light brown coat and notably large ears, this fox exudes an air of curiosity and alertness. Um, we we're supposed to go to our journal. Oh, God, there's so many people to read through. Um, home sweet home. Claim reward. Amazing. We got some gold. The new farmer. Meet townies. Um, we got to harvest our first crop, too. Let's see. Hold on. We're going to look through. Oh, mastery? Oh. Chance for watered soil to stay watered the following day quality crops oh you spend oh this is like skill trees foraging oh that's cool that's gonna be really really nice fancy um relationship alice alice runs a family in with her twin sister suki she likes discussing unexplained phenomena which she discovered a little back in the university oh she's a ghost hunter archie can sometimes be found in the vineyard playing with taco he loves animals and wants to be a vet one day cute Chame is an athlete in training who dreams of entering a national volleyball competition one day. She works part-time as a lifeguard. Cool. Connor. We've already seen Connor and Dinda. When she isn't working, Erica, when she isn't working at the hair salon, Erica can be found volunteering at school or hanging out around town, lending an ear and giving advice free of charge. She seems really fun. Eva is a talented baker who enjoys talking to the islanders, locals, newcomers, visitors, everybody. And she has many good friends. Jack. Jack is the island's rancher and he lives with his family in a humble cabin in the forest. He doesn't celebrate birthdays. Oh, Jack is not single. That is that is unfortunate. Joko's local carpenter. He's married to Dinda, who's also a carpenter. Has a family at a neighboring island. It visits them. I think we've already seen that. Luke runs socket and pan electronics and his family business. Hillside Manor and Vineyard. He's known for being a foodie and for his tendency to overthink things. He's also not single? Wait, does it say single, single, Oh, no, Luke is single. I guess it shouldn't show up here. Luke is single. Jack is not single, unfortunate. Okay. Millie works the library and oversees a museum. She spends her free time bird watching and restoring old books. Noah spends his days keeping fish and ships running. On the rare occasion he's free, he enjoys long walks with his mother, Betty, and discussing theories about unexplained phenomena with his close friend, Alex. So he's also a ghost hunter. Nice. Oliver wants to join the police force when he grows up. He loves detective shows and dreams of becoming a police detective. Cute. Raphael's a local blacksmith. He's reserved and prefers silence. Sometimes something that he considers a perk of his line of work. Randy Barnes is a teacher with a remarkable ability to explain complex ideas in a simple and easy to understand manner. And he loves classic literature. Sam owns and runs a general store. He spends his time doing brain exercises, such as chess, jigsaw puzzles, and crossword puzzles. He also goes dancing with his wife, Emily. Cute. Man, Sam is, Sam is giving me very, like, Alfred vibes from Batman. Um, Suki. Uh, Suki runs the end with her twin sister. She's a mom first and everything else comes second. Healthy living is important to her. I wondered if she was a mom with the stretch marks. That's really cool they included those. Theo. Theo's a local fisherman who spends most of his days fishing or playing guitar. On the weekends, he performs at fishing ships to make a quick buck. Valentina enjoys hanging out with her friends and family. She lives at the inn and often plays at the beach. Zara is an adventurer at heart. She enjoys searching the island for all kinds of treasures, gems, artifacts, or buried history. Fun. Zia, Zoe's a wildlife enthusiast, just like her parent. She enjoys volleyball, bird watching, and winter. And we're back to Alice. So yeah, let's see. It's Alice, Chame, uh, Eva... Luke, Millie, Noah, Raphael, Theo, Suki, and Zara. Fun. Cool. Um, oh, we had a little sparkle from us getting some money. Let's go back to the farm. I want to see if we can't try to meet the rest of the villagers today. Um, I think that would be good. It's only 1230. So yeah, I think they should be able to do that. They show up on the map, which is so convenient. Stranger. Oh, oh, what? 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 <laughs> So speedy. Oh, oh my goodness. Speedy. Speedy. 
Oh, we go, we do, we leaps. We do leaps. Oh, hello. Hi. Betty. Oh, how lovely to see a new face around here. You can call me Betty, dear. Oh, she's cute. You're the first visitor we've had in a while. After the oil spill last year, tourists hardly come anymore. Well, that's sad. We definitely got to work on that, huh? Oil spill, huh? I have a, me, ha, me has a feeling that that will be a, a major plot point. Um, another stranger over there on the beach. Huh. Zoom. Zoom, 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 zoom. We haven't been on the beach yet. Ooh, harvest. Ooh, a cockle. Oh, a silver star cockle. Okay. Oh, there's a beach shack. Oh, we have more shells to pick up. Where was that? Oh, my inventory's full. You know, that's fine. Um, the stranger is out in the middle of the water. Can we go into the water? Oh, we can. Oh my God, there's so many shells around here. Oh, hi. Okay, okay. Sunny, the new farmer. Welcome, welcome. All right, sir. Hi, Theo. How are you doing today, buddy? I sing to chill out my soul. Hopefully it hits the same notes for anyone who listens. Oh, Amy, want to hear my new song? I wrote it yesterday. Sure. Flowers, you beautiful flowers. As beautiful as the eyes of my love. Mmm. You're kind of no thoughts head empty, aren't you? Yeah. That body on that frame, but a half a brain. Yeah, mm-hmm. Yep, that seems... Oh, another stranger. Hello. Ro Raj. Hello. I don't think I've seen you before. Are you new in town? Wow. See you around. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Whew. Um, oh, flower bouquet crafting recipe. Yes. I have figured out how to craft by now. Crafting menu. Fiber in any flower. Press a craft. Once crafted, put it in your backpack. Okay. Well, I think we, um, oh, we just need to go do it. Okay. We can do that. We have a flower. I don't know if we have enough flowers, but I guess we can find out. What was it? Actually, let's just, uh, hold on. Betty. Betty is retired and spends her days ref refilling the bird feeders in town. Oh, that's what she's doing. She's refilling the bird feeders. That's so cute. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag. E educating kids about coral reefs and baking pastries. She's perfect. Love her. No notes. Um, where was the ones we just met? Uh, I see Raj. Where's the other one? We just met someone. Oh, Sunny. Yes. Sunny runs the beach shack. Though he doesn't often fish anymore, he still keeps pictures of his monster fish catches upstairs at his house. That's cute. Sunny's fun. Raj. <sighs> Raj is a <laughs> coffee connoisseur who runs a small outdoor uh, co coffee cafe in Starlet Town. They live at the end. Oh, Raj is, uh, Raj is they them. That's awesome. That's really cool. I will have to remember that. Man, Raj is something. Okay. Cool. Full, full non-binary powers right there. Amazing. Um, okay. We have to figure out how to craft a flower bouquet. We have to find our way home first to do that. Okay. We'll have to figure out how to like catch these bugs and stuff. That'll be fun. It's so pretty though. It's it's definitely laggy. I'm a bit, yep, it, it's laggy, but um, I might play around with the settings uh, later and see if we can't make that work out for us a little bit better. Let's, um actually, while we're out here, let's boop, boop. We're gonna plant some of these crops that we just got. I wanna get rid of this tree too, cause I kinda can't see over it. There we go. It'll be worth it to plant these crops, I think. Oh, how do we? No, wait. Inventory, maybe? Mastery. Inventory. Oh, this is in our backpack. How do you rotate things in and out of your backpack? I don't actually know. Um, We have a violet. Let's put our carrot seeds down as well. Okay. Eight. Boop, boop. Nine. Boop, boop. And then I just need like one more. Oh, this is going to be uneven. I apologize in advance. Um, can we, yeah, we can scroll up and down. That's good. Okay. Um, I'm used to with Paley, I've been needing to actually select the number. So 
let's knock this tree down just so I can uh, see what is going on here. Eh. 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 So we can always, always use more wood. Um, okay, this will be uneven. I apologize in advance. It bothers me just as much as it bothers you. Um, okay, two. Boop, boop. All right, and then we'll water all of these. Mm -hmm. Water, 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 water. Very good. Okay. All right, uh, let's see. Can we craft a flower bouquet? That's a good question. Um, flower bouquet. One fiber and any five flowers. Well, I don't think they've taken that one flower that we got earlier. Yeah, so we can put that back in our inventory. I guess I'll put the cockle in there just so that we can make some money off of it maybe. We got a morel, so I guess we'll need that too. Although, I feel like I've been told that maybe we need to keep, hang on to stuff. Oh God, I don't know what we need to hang on to when we don't. I think I'll just keep maybe one of everything. <laughs> Just so that we don't have to worry about it. We got some wood, which is good. Um, we have the fiber that we need. We just need to... I don't know what we use co compost for. Use craft fertilizer. Okay. Well, I guess maybe let's run around the island a little bit more. And see if we can't find... Oh, my goodness. That's some, that's some big pitcher plants right there. My goodness gracious. Um, let's run around the island a little more. And see if we can't find some more flowers. Oh. 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 There's a kitty. The cows are so chunky. Look at how chunky. Oh my god, they're so chunky. Chunky babies. <laughs> also got llamas and pigs. I'm assuming this is the ranch. That's fun. Oh, it's starting to get dark. Yeah, let's see if we can't like find some more flowers and maybe craft that bouquet that we were we were looking for. Oh yeah, it's nighttime. That's okay. We can like look around cavern. Okay. We're picking up just some random stuff. Harvest. Okay. Canola. I don't know if that's um counts as a flower or not, but we'll just get lost in the weeds a little bit and see if we can't find ourselves some flowers. We just need two more. Ooh, there's like a something up here. We can't look at it yet. That's a big space though. A big temple looking thingy. Okay. Oh, there's a tree. Oh, but the tree's dead. But that's a spirit. Um, like, that'd be something they would use to enshrine or honor trees, I think. The spirit... It's not spirit rope. That's the wrong word for it, but... A bunch of wood. Oh, more canola. Okay, I don't know if this... I, I mean, it looks like a flower, so maybe. Two canola. Maybe we just need one more. And then we can make the flower bouquet. Oh, oh, danger. Okay, good to know. Can't go in there. You hear the clanking of swords inside. You wonder if there's some fighting going on. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, fireflies. Cute. And another canola. Is this a flower? Does it count? Crafting. Yes. Oh, I made a flower bouquet. Okay. Gift it to someone. Equip the item you'd like to give. Approach the character you want to surprise with a gift. And spread the joy. Cute. Oh, well, we'll have to figure out who we're going to gift it to. I think maybe I might want to gift it to the librarian. She's really cute. I want to be friends with her. <coughs> worm. There's a little worm thingy. I don't know if the library's still open or not. They did joke about it being ever closed, though, so I guess maybe we can go look. This is what? Ranch, yes. We're at the ranch. Oh, hello. Kenny. Oh, you're Amy? I heard about you. You're looking I heard you're looking some fresh air away from the city. Kenny, you're also hot. Well, I think you came to the right place. Why is everyone so buff? Hope you find it here. Fresh air, peace of mind, whatever it might be. That's nice of you. You look like a courier. And you're hot. Oh, it's your take mushroom. That's nice. Um I shall now proceed to get lost again. Not too terrible. What was I going to look at? Hold on. What? Dinda's Herb Garden. Oh, that's cute. <coughs> okay, we're going to run back into town. Whoosh. Whoosh. Oh, another mushroom. Oh, yeah, we haven't checked out the vineyard yet. That's fun. We got a morel. 
which is nice. We're picking up some stuff. Oh, is this like a restaurant? Oh, this was the vineyard, right? I, it looks like I can go in even though it's late. Oh, okay. Oh, is this just me leaving? Oops. Let's go back in. I'm just curious. <coughs> oh, okay. Yeah, this, it do be a vineyard. Inspect. You think some of these wines are older than Luke. Then you realize you don't even know how old Luke is. Oh, was Luke the one that was running the vineyard? Good to know. Oh, okay. Let's see if we can't go back over to the library. Ooh. This is so fancy. Oh, there's like a little greenhouse. Oh, we can go in the greenhouse. Can we get a greenhouse? Oh, oh, that's so cool. Ooh, nifty. Ooh, can we open the chest? It's locked, but it smells like fertilizer from here. That would make sense. Fun. That's so bougie in here. That's nice. I wonder if we can get a greenhouse eventually. That would be really cute. Okay. Um, let's go back. I keep saying we're going to go to the library and see if it's open. Because if it is, I think we might gift it to, uh, what was that? Huh. Ben. Um, ah, he's one of those. Ah, a new face. Feeling really good vibes from you, mate. Oh, you're Australian. You sound all Australian with the mate. Um, Okay. You know, the library might be open, but I don't know if she's here. Yeah, that's a good point. I guess we'll try to come back tomorrow then. Wait, I could look at something. Lookies? Lookies? Oh, I can talk. Frankie's busy and can't talk right now. Yeah, they are asleep. So cute. Oh my God. I literally can't tell if I want the Luna, the Foxy, or the bunny. Oh, the bunny's so cute. I don't know if they'll let you have multiple pets. We're going to have to find out. That's just mm, perfection. Um. Okay, home. Try not to get lost. It's a big map. I love it, though. It's so cool. And you move at a pretty good clip, too, which is really nice. And later, this isn't going to be able to get a horse, which would be amazing. So we will definitely have to, uh, to do that. Okay, hold on. Um... Let's see. Let's keep the shiitake. We already have a morel, so we'll keep that on us. Trash. Okay, I think we're good. Let us go to bed. Go nippity nappity. Night night. Amazing. Oh yeah, there's a TV and everything. How to be a farmer, weather forecast, and coral shopping. Fun. Go to bed. We'll check the weather tomorrow. Oh, okay. We got the candy tree seed. That's good. Oh, and we leveled up. Oh, we leveled up forging. That would be why. <laughs> we didn't sell anything yesterday. I forgot to put it in the shipping bin. I was literally going to, and then I just like forgot. That's fine. That is fine. I think we'll do one more day, and then I think we'll probably be done from there. Um, how to be a farmer. How to be a farmer with Jeff Smith. My name is Jeff Smith, and I know a thing or two about farming. I was raised in a farm, so I got some tips for you, Sprouts. Let me tell you about them. Okay. My, I'm in your hands, Jeff. I'm going to tell you the first thing my pop told me when I planted my first corn in 19XLXI. Uh, oh my God. I feel like I should know. No. XI would be 11. But L. L is not a Roman numeral. I don't think. Yeah, no, whatever. They're they're joking, but you know. Water your crops every day. That's it. You get that down, chances you are you'll be okay, Sprouts. You don't need to water when it's raining, you hear? Oh, is it raining today? Weather forecast. Welcome to WWBC, your main weather-related news source. This forecast covers Coral, Ireland, and the surrounding area. Tomorrow's going to be rainy. Good to know. Coral stars. Passion and music bring these five girls together, but can they come overcome the harsh world of sea pop? Hello, producers. I'll be your representative in the show. Welcome to Coral Stars. Today, five girls will start their fight in the world of C-pop. They will start their voice lessons, memorize choreography, and give their all in stages prepared to test their result practices. Sir, I hate to be a nitpick, but that is six girls. I do see six girls in this picture, and it's not five. However, 
Your participation will also be essential in realizing the dreams of these hopeful idols. Now, without further ado, Coral Stars, please introduce yourselves. Oh, I guess it's five. Star in your eyes, hello. We are Coral Stars. As you can see, they're very determined to debut. Leader, any words for our producers? Yes, producers, thank you for giving us the chance to showcase our skills. We'll not let you down, always perform our best. Very good. Next week, we'll have our first choreography lesson with a C-pop veteran, so be sure to stay tuned, producers. Goodbye. Next week on Coral Stars. With that attitude, you should quit before wasting everyone's time. Coral Stars are not facing the harsh truth. Can they weather the storm? Oh, my God. So much drama. More passion. More passion. More energy. More energy. Oh, it's raining. Good, so we don't have to water. Oh, look at our crops. They're coming along. That's cute. Okay. Let's see. Read mail. Hello, Amy. Looking for a way to pass the time? Or maybe you want to earn extra coins while waiting for your crops to grow? When you have the time, please visit us at the Beach Shack. We have the perfect welcome gifts for you. Okay. I will do that. Sunny and Eleanor. I also will maybe clear out my farm a little bit more. I haven't really been bothering, but, like, might as well. I've got a little bit of time. I think one of the first things we're going to do today is we're going to, um, go gift our, um... We do want to leave, no, we do want to leave some grass if I know anything about games like these. Do want to read, leave some grass just so that whenever we have animals, we can get, oh, wait, we're already getting hay. Never mind. I guess we'll still want to have some, I think, but, you know, um, sorry, words. Um, wow, now I really don't remember what I was talking about. It's okay. We're going to get the, um, We'll go check out what Sunny and Eleanor have for us. We're gonna give the, uh, the thing to, or the, uh, oh my gosh, words. We're gonna give, is that just like a thing on the ground? Oh, oh, it's a seed. Oh, it's a seed. Okay, okay, cool. We're gonna gift the, um, <coughs> the bouquet to the librarian. She's cute. And Bessie's energy. I need time to decide whom I shall date. So we shall wait on giving romantic gifts until I'm more certain. This game is, this game is already really cute. Like, I am enjoying myself. Give the smack to the trash. Yeah, I think we'll probably finish this day, and then I think that'll be it for tonight. I would, I would frankly, so I think, I'm gonna have to check, but I think it looks like it's only saving at the end of days, which is fine, but like, I don't know. I... Like, I would prefer it if it didn't, but we're going to find out. Um, maybe it doesn't. Maybe I'm wrong. But I think that's how it's working, which is fine. That's how Stardew worked. It's just really not my favorite because it makes it kind of hard to, like, modulate how long you play and that kind of thing. But I would frankly continue longer because I'm having a great time. But uh, my voice is giving out a little bit. So. Because I can't quite seem to shake this darn cold, which is fine. Okay, looks like we've worn down our energy a little bit. That's good. Bonk, 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 wackus bonkus. You naughty wackus bonkus. Okay, um. And then we'll do this. Okay. All right. Oh, nope. That's a stray weed we missed. Can, can it spread off the edge of the farm as well? I guess it can a little bit onto the path. Okay. Oh, got more, more glass. That's good. Okay, let's dump our stuff and then keep the trash because that's all craftable. Um, wood, glass. I guess we'll keep all the seeds because we can make that candied seed recipe, which is really convenient. Yeah, we have this one morel that I think I'll put into the shipping bin to sell. Okay, let's run into town and we're going to go um, check out the librarian and give her uh, the little bouquet. Oh. oh, the music is so pleasant. And the rain's nice, too. I normally hate rain, but this is really cute. Oh, all the animals are inside because it's rainy today. That's adorable. Cherry Blossom Festival. Oh, I guess that's going to be the next festival, huh? I love the little stained glass bit at the top. That was really cool. Oh. Hello. Lily, um, yes? I haven't seen you around here before. Are you new? Okay. Hi. Frank. Whoa, look who's finally here. The new farmer, right? I'm Frank. Folks at the tavern have been asking about you. Oh yeah, you're the uh you're you're the husband. Um 
She she mentioned to go visit the tavern. I haven't got around to it yet. You should stop by sometime. I will whenever I get a chance. Okay. Um, well, here she is. Hi. Millie, have you noticed the weather channel isn't always accurate? It makes it hard to plan my days out. This is true in real life. It very much sucks. Once you donate a certain number of items, you're welcome to collect a reward. Oh, okay, so you're going to be kind of like a reward thing. Okay, here's a gift. Gift the flower bouquet to Millie. Yes. I hope this wasn't too much trouble. I accept. Thank you. Amazing. Okay. So, got that. I completed it. There's no reward for it. You just complete it. That's okay. Um, visit the beach shack. Oh. Oh, I see. Yes, let us go visit the beach shack. We shall do that. Oh, sorry, I'm just looking at everything. It's so pretty in here. Oh, hi. How are you, Noah? I hope there isn't a leak in the community center. I'm going to check out the library, or I'm going to check on the library when the rain settles down. If you have time, try some of our food and drinks. They're the Islanders' favorites. They also make great gifts. It's an easy way to win people over, you know? Good to know. I'll keep that in mind. Let us go check out the beach shack, I think. Oh, hey. Theo, right? I hope this new year gives you a chance for a fresh start, Amy. Whether that means taking another run at your goals or maybe setting some new ones. That's nice of you. Gotta hand it to Betty, though. She's out there making sure our feathered friends don't go hungry. Yeah, she has her goals and priorities very much in line. <coughs> Actually, I'm headed your way anyway, buddy, because we gotta go to the beach shack, which I'm gonna make sure I'm doing correctly. Oh, it looks like I can get down there. I love how, like, big this town is. It's also very spread out. It's not, like, very, like, one note. It's very, like, complex, which is fun. Oh, there's a big flower. Oh, is that a daffodil? Yeah, it's a daffodil. That's fun. Okay. Hello, everyone. I'm supposed to come to the beach shack. How are we all doing today? Oh, hello. Oh, Eleanor. Oh, I don't think I met her yet. What? Sunny, we can't do that to the new farmer. Oh, I love the bees on her, her, her little suit jacket. That's so cute. Poor thing will get overwhelmed if we give both things at once. Okay, then we start with fishing. I think, I think... The implication here is that Sonny is a little hard of hearing at this stage of his life. Who doesn't like fishing? I speak to people like him every single day on the phone. Maybe it wouldn't be such a bad idea to... Oh, yes, I am here. I am observing you. Welcome! A new face at last! Amy, isn't it? Jim! Amy is here! Nice to meet ya! Hmm? Oh, who's this gentleman? <coughs> Nice to finally meet you, Amy. Come have a seat. We were just discussing your welcome gifts. Oh, welcome gifts? You didn't have to. Everyone's awfully nice. It's fine if you prefer to stand. Gotta keep those leg muscles strong, eh? Speaking of leg muscles... Oh, my... That is... Oh, I wasn't expecting whatever noise that was. That, like, was, like, by urinal. Like, it went in one earbud and then, like, went to the... Whoa, that was... Whoa. Speaking of less mug muscles, I have the perfect workout for you. Catching bugs. Sit, sit, Amy. Oh, one told me to stay and one told me to sit. I'll sit. So, how's farm life so far? Uh, nothing I can't handle. Hehe, <laughs> that's the spirit. Resilient youngster. Reminds me a lot of myself. All right, sir, please. Settle a debate for us, Amy. Which is the better activity, fishing or fun and ever-exciting bug catching? Hehe, <laughs> my wife, the competitive ladybug size um hmm okay so here's the thing i used to be a fishing girly like that used to be more my style and then i feel like lately i have switched to more of like a bug hunting girly <coughs> oh my god that's the sound of the the cafe isn't it oh like you're like shaking drinks or something you're like an espresso machine it's just making my brain be like whoo it's giving me that, like, ASMR brain tickle. Um, yeah, so <laughs> the thing about fishing is I love the collection of the fish. Like, I love, because I'm I'm currently doing an Animal Crossing run for myself. Um, I love catching the fish, and I love collecting them and putting them in the museum. 
as just an idle money-making strategy. I like bug catching more because it's more exciting and moves faster and you don't have to sit around for like 4,000 hours waiting for the fish to bite. Also like, I feel like fish catching in most games is never really profitable enough. Not for the amount of work you put, like the time you put in. So I don't know. Also, my brain's starting to like the idea of the, I see the thing, I go, hem. I go, hem. I grab it, grip. So I guess I'll do bug catching. Thank goddess. Vibes. Looks like I'll finally have a fellow bug enthusiast. Well, in any case, here's our welcome gift for you. A fishing rod and a bug net. Thank you. I appreciate it. You're both very cute. Thank you. You can sell your cat or donate it to the museum. Looks like they're going to need it. Good luck. Look at the sand on the floor. That's such a cute detail. Oh, my God. All right. Hi, everybody. Oh, what can I do for you? Oh, small fish bait, grilled fish, whole coconut drink fun um back upgrade tools oh fishing pole bronze kelp essence and wood oh osmium kelp essence osmium kelp how do you get kelp essence also they're so pretty they're like galaxy colored but oh he's in buenos dias Oh, so you're, are you Spanish then? Wonderful. Oh, I'm not going to hide today. I'm afraid I might slip. Oh my, stop teasing. Not a joke. I was being serious. Coral Island is just so beautiful in the spring. I'm glad I moved here. That's cute that she works here. Oh, is this, uh, Sam? It's important for me to visit these folks often to make sure I can still beat them at chess. Hey, NPC named Jim. Did you hear that? Oop, that's a bug. The tavern is one of the oldest buildings on this island, aside from the mansion, that is. It's been refurbished many times, so you probably can't tell. Okay, thank you for all the tips. I love the boat. The boat seat. I love... Can I have romantic dates in the boat seat? Oh, the little Norin. Or, um, Norin. Yeah, the little Norin. Cute. Hi. Hi, NPC named Jim. The rain brings out different kinds of fish. Giant mud skippers are easier to catch in this weather. If you want to talk, Sunny seems to be in the mood to chat. Oh, you're busy. Me? No, I'm not. Okay, sir. Sorry, sir. I love your little kitchen, though, sir. Okay, we've met a couple. Oh, oh, oh who's this? Oh, is this a uh, Wataru? Wait. Oh, he's busy. Hi, Wataru. Unfortunate. Hold on. We just met some NPCs. Let's check them out. We've got more crafting stuff. Oh, the candied tree seed. Fun. Yeah, more relationship stuff. Okay, who did we just meet? Um... Jim. Jim helps Sonny run the beach shack as a cook. He makes a killer smoked salmon that he sometimes sells at the shack. Cool. Pardon me. Um, Kenny. We met Kenny. Kenny's lived on Coral Island his whole life and has fostered close relationships with other islanders, people, animal, tree spirits from beyond. All of them. He's single. Oh, he is single. Oh, Kenny's single. Okay. Lily. I think we just met Lily. Lily works remotely for a cybersecurity company and has no set working hours. She loves sol solitude and bonsai. Nice, Lily's cool. I were I've I have technically worked for a cybersecurity company as well. It was not exciting. I just sold subscriptions <laughs> to this a cybersecurity product, so like, you know, not exciting, but I've done it. So I know somewhat about it. Um, let's see. Raj, they're cool. Alright, that looks like everything we knew we met so far. Was there like a um There was like extras, right? No new extras. Okay, cool. All right. Cool. I inspect. Fresh coconuts. Legit. Ooh. Oh. Oh, the tatami. Not close enough sign to enter this room. Oh, he said Buenos Dias, but he has tatami the I mean, that's fine. I'm just like, that's just kind of interesting. Oh my god, they're so cute. Oh, someone likes maps. Oh, wait. Is this um Oliver? Yeah, it's Oliver's room. That's cute because he wants to be a detective. So there's little police cars. That's really cute. Cool. I love, I love how complex all their houses are. That's really nifty. Okay, so we have the ability to um, fish and catch bugs now. I mean, first things first, I think I'm just going to collect everything off the beach. 
Oh, okay, just a stone. All right. There's like a ton of stuff out here. So I guess it's worth collecting and stuff. Like, I mean, I guess maybe there's a bunch of trash and stuff. Poor beach. Oh, there's so much trash. I mean, I, I can collect the trash because I, I know I can use it to craft things. That might be kind of nice. I mean, I only have so much energy to be fair, but I guess I can maybe try to craft more um, uh, food with some of the tree seeds I have. Ooh, bronze kelp. Oh, hey, bron ke bronze kelp essence. That was the thing. <laughs> Apparently the kitty is over <laughs> over me streaming. That's okay. I won't be streaming for much longer. Oh my goodness. Okay. We're just going to clean up our little beach all cozy like. There's a lifeguard. Oh, we're running out of energy. Oh, there's a volleyball in that. Fun. Um, does it take it? It does not take energy to harvest. That is good. That's good to note. Because uh, it means we can pick stuff out without too much worry. I don't know if it takes energy to catch bugs. I guess we're going to find out. We're going to... Clean up this trash so it's not so dirty. Because that really sucks. Great Pacific garbage patch. Uh, vibes. Oh, the boat. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's a, um, mm. don't know what it's called, but there's a, so I think that's a type of Chinese boat. That's really fun. That's really cute. Oh, I can go dashy dash. Oh, ew. Oh, these were the concerning black th like black tentacle things we saw when we were coming in that sucks we should definitely uh definitely not deal with that Ugh. or definitely de not deal with but like we need to deal with it so it's not polluting the oceans anymore that sucks let's see anything else more interesting to harvest Ugh, more black stuff just mostly trash i am sure the vibes very quickly are going to be about us cleaning this place up and I am all about that. Ugh. Oh, look at it. Oh, it's awful. Looks like something out of like a movie. <laughs> like a, you know, like a, a Marvel movie where like Venom or something. Like that's like the, 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 the bad guy, the evil. It looks like we can't really get through here. Ugh. Oh, gross. Yeah. Definitely could use to clean that up. I'm just looking at the bat turn back corners. Nothing super interesting over here. I'm just exploring mostly. We're still kind of like the biggest, uh, all cute, the little lounge chairs. Oh, I wonder what's up here. Kind of taking the, oh, it just takes us right back up, huh? Oh, that's convenient. That's nice. Yeah, I'm sure, um, rainy days are really good for fishing, probably. Oh, fun. Okay. All right, well, oh, whose house is this? I mean, it might not be open right now. Oh, no, I guess we're going in. We're going in. Kitty. Butter. Meow. Butter's so cute. Butter's extremely cute. How about you? Peanut. Peanut butter. Ah, I see. Playing with peanut makes you want to rescue a million cats. Amen. Oh, there's like scooters and stuff. It's like a scooter mechanic. That's cool. Oh, and then there's litter boxes for the cats. Cute. Um, they're just playing with each other. Okay, Erica and Frank. Okay, that's a cute... That's a cute room. Room goals. Oh my God. It's a whole cat room. Absolutely goals. Incredible. Oh my God. All this cat furniture can't be cheap. No, it can. Oh my God. I love it so much. Oh, hi. Hey, it's Frank. I can't, I guess I already spoke to Frank today. He's hanging out watching TV. We will leave Frank alone then. I love all their plants. I love their cats. This is wonderful. Okay. Oh, more flowers. Yes, good. Inventory's full. Well, I suppose. We'll definitely have to work on saving up for that um, that inventory upgrade, huh? So I guess it isn't worth it to try to catch bugs or anything because we are full up. I want to hang on to some of these flowers just so that uh, we can keep them for potential bouquets in the future because they're really cute. <coughs> okay, let's go put our stuff away. We have, 
I don't know. Should we keep the cockles? I guess we'll... I want to keep one. Oh, my inventory's full. That's right. Put that stone away. I want to keep one and then maybe sell the others. But we'll keep the flower. We'll keep one of the shells. Ooh, a scrap. Scrap recycle from trash. It could be used for ca crafting. Gotta keep that bronze kelp. Absolutely. Got a ton of trash, but I'm sure we can craft a ton of stuff with it. So yeah, I guess we'll drop some of the stuff off, like the shells and stuff. The cockles. There we go. Okay. We'll make some money tomorrow morning then for, for, for that. So, um, all right. I think that's probably going to be about it. Um, so we'll just go ahead and like go to bed and, and see what happens in the morning. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a uh, lovely rest of your evening. I would stream just a little bit longer, but my, my voice is giving out on me. So we're just going to kind of end it here. Uh, oh, good. 146 for forging. That's good. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a lovely, lovely rest of your evening. Um, I will see you again on Friday. Oh. You felt a large impact last night. Yeah. It looked like it was coming from inside the house. That was scary. Anyway. Oh, and it made some money. That's good. Anyway, um, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a lovely rest of your evening. Um, as always, if you have missed any of the streams, um, please feel free to check out my VODs channel on um, YouTube. That's Amy's VODs on YouTube. Um, and I keep all of my... Um, uh, Oh, wow. I can't, sorry. I can't move my, the time, whatever. I keep, I have all the VODs there. Um, they're all divided into convenient playlists. Uh, so you can search by game um, and you can kind of catch up on the things that we have been working on. Um, I also stream both on YouTube and Twitch. Um, so whichever feels the most comfortable for you, whichever you like the most. Um, on YouTube, it's Amy's Adventures Gaming and on Twitch, it's Amy's Adventures. Um, so feel free to check that out and just like do whatever feels the most comfortable to you. Also, um, please check out the Instagram it's Amy's Adventures Gaming on Instagram. Um, that is where I post my stream schedules every week. Uh, so you can kind of know like what to look forward to and what will be going on and that kind of thing. Um, and what kind of streams you, you want to watch and things like that. But yeah, anyway, um, thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope you have a lovely rest of your evening. And I will see you on Friday. We finally back with Dream Life for the first time in like forever. So um, bye guys.